guys welcome back to my channel my name is jen if you are new i am in spain i'm in madrid right now we just got here yesterday with my family and we're doing a little family trip for a couple of weeks so this is going to be a spain travel vlog i'm so excited to be here we're doing madrid for a few days and we're going to valencia Barcelona and then back to Madrid for the last couple of days and I'm gonna get to spend my birthday here Which I'm so excited about that's like at the end of my trip um, once we're back in Madrid So so much fun stuff planned. We're heading out right now for the first time to go explore around Madrid a little bit um, I think we're going to Plaza Mayor and the palace and things like that um, So I'll show it of course, but yeah I'm so excited. This is their first time in Europe and kind of out of the country in a really, really long time. Um, and it's my first time exploring Madrid, um, like for real. So, so excited, but yeah, take you long. Subscribe if you're new, let's go. So it is day three of our trip so far. Yesterday we went to a guided tour. It was really, really long. It was like eight hours. And we went to Avila and Segovia, which were super, super cool. It was like Castle Princess Diaries vibes. Um, I'll put pictures right here. It was so cool. <laughs> This is my water ripple when you drop the coin down. He explained the history of so many things. They gave us like a small little snack and then wine, um, but it was just a lot of walking. So we were super, super tired from that and didn't get back till really late, but we had a really nice dinner also at this Italian restaurant. So yesterday we were just kind of beat and took the day off, but today we are traveling to Valencia and our train leaves in about two hours, three hours, something like that. Um, and then from there, we're staying there for another three days. So. Today's a traveling day. We'll probably explore a little bit and like walk around once we get there. Um, but this morning we went to a flea market. They're doing, I guess they do flea markets in Madrid every Sunday. And it's like a huge flea market where everybody comes out, brings out antiques and things like that. No, 
Yeah. It was super cool. I didn't end up buying anything, but they had really, really good, um, like antique jewelry and books, and it was just really, really cool. But yeah, that's the plan for today. We're gonna make it to Valencia, and then we'll see where the day takes us. It's the next day. We got to Valencia last night. We took the train from Madrid to Valencia. It was only like two hours, and we practically slept the whole time, so it was super fast. And then we got here, had dinner. Um, and then today we woke up in Valencia, but today is actually a national holiday So there's not a lot of stuff open which our server told us last night that there wouldn't be a lot of like restaurants or stores or anything like that open um, Because it's observed all day But she did say that the monuments and more touristy areas should be open at least to like walk around and look outside So I think that's what we're gonna do today. We're just gonna explore and walk all around um, and then hopefully make it to the beach for a sunset. I think that'd be really cool But mostly just like a walking around day seeing like the touristy sites and then tomorrow We'll probably be able to like go inside places and explore a little bit more But this is my little outfit of the day. I actually really like it I got this little tank top from cotton on for their black friday sale I think I paid like three dollars for it and it's like a square neck with really thick um, Straps which I really like and then I also got these jeans on black friday from levi's and they fit really really nicely They're like straight leg jeans and then this button up I got from Cotton On too. So I'll probably wear this with like a coat over because it is still really cold here too. But yeah. going to the beach I think we'll probably do that tomorrow but now we're in this little store by where they have Christmas lights and they have the cutest stuff so I'll show you Airbnb we ended up going to this little like plaza center that I told you guys about they did like a little Christmas lighting It was super super pretty. It was called Plaza de Ayuntamiento something like that I'll put the name here. This one was closest to our Airbnb So we went and they did a Christmas lighting. There was ice skating. There was there was a merry-go-round It was super pretty. There was Christmas lights everywhere. There was a ton of people also So we just walked around there and then we went shopping which you guys saw too. I'll show you guys what I got It was like the cutest store it was kind of like Zara H&M vibes, but a lot more like funky stuff, which I really appreciated. The store was called Pull and Bear, and I got a few things. The first thing that I got were these pants, and they have kind of like a lighter tan color and then a darker tan color in this checkered design. They fit super nicely, and they fit really nice on the back too, and the back pockets had different colors too. So these are really cute. They're really, really long, but I think like with tall high boots or like heels or something, they'll look really cute. So that was the first thing. And then I also got something that I think I want to wear either for my birthday or New Year's, like a special occasion because it's like super sparkly shimmery. It's this like green blue kind of like aquamarine color skirt. It's super sparkly and it's really, really short. And this is a slit right here. You can't really see it, but it's a slit. It fits really, really nicely, like not too tight, but then long enough so where it's kind of flowy on the bottom. And it had a matching top, which I didn't really try on the top. So hopefully it works out. But 
The top was like a v-neck long sleeve, also in the same pattern, same color, literally same texture, everything. So it's kind of like a matching set. And then it's a little bit scrunched right here. So I think that'll be really cute. And then the last thing I got, I also think that I want to wear either for my birthday or for New Year's because it has kind of like that same vibe. It's this little black dress, but it has a really cute cutout. So where it kind of lays on your body like this and it goes across. I think I took a video of it in the dress, in the dressing room, but it's super, super cute. And it was only like 20 euros. So probably like $25, something around those lines. But the store was super cute. They have an online store also. So I'll try to link them if I can find them if they ship overseas, but I really, really enjoy that store. So we went to that. Then we went to dinner and got burgers at this place it was super good um and now we're back at the airbnb and tomorrow is going to be like kind of our full day in valencia where we go walk around and then i think we have tickets for the aquarium midday around three and then at night i think we're gonna go back to the same place and just see more christmas lights and things like that so super cool super fun but right now i think i'm just gonna get ready for bed and get some rest overall successful day <music> six maybe we are in Valencia still we leave tomorrow but today we spent all day basically walking we walked all the way to um, the Center of Arts and Sciences which also has an aquarium which we also went to it was super cool um, so we basically were walking there all day and we passed by this really beautiful park and then we went into the aquarium and we were there for like four or five hours but it was super cool they have like this tank where all the fish and the sharks swim above you which is really cool i'm like vlogging on my phone because i don't have the energy to go downstairs at the airbnb and get my vlog camera but it was really really cool and then from there we went to this other little center which had mostly little restaurants but they had a huge christmas tree which was really fun too so just a lot a lot of walking today we're really tired but our train leaves at like 7 a.m tomorrow for barcelona and then from there we're there for like four days so we're there for a good chunk of time um, and then this Valencia trip was like super fast, but it was really, really nice. The weather was really cool. It like reminded me a lot of California. It was like really nice and hot during the day. Um, and then it got really cold at night and it was like a little bit windy. It was like very beach town vibes. So I really liked it. And our Uber driver said that the best time to come is in March because they do kind of like a Burning Man type thing where they create these giant, beautiful sculptures that are supposed to represent different things and like political, not propaganda, that's not the right word, but like criticisms. Uh, through these sculptures and then at the end on March 19th, I believe he said they burn all the sculptures down So I thought that was super interesting and super cool So just a little tidbit that we learned today, but we're off to Barcelona tomorrow super early. So it's time to sleep.
Hello, it is day eight, I think. Yesterday we went to the Sagrada Familia and the Park Coel, and it was super, super cool. We had, uh, we went through the inside and then we just kind of walked around the whole day, took pictures, um, and it was really, really, really cool. It was like one of the prettiest buildings I've ever seen in my life and I like don't understand how someone came up with that in their mind. It was super cool. Um, and then we just went to dinner at this Mexican spot, which was really good. Today we're going to Montserrat Monastery and we have tickets to see the choir at 1 p.m. And it's about an hour from Barcelona on train, so we're headed out right now. And it has really cool views, so we'll probably stay there the whole day, walk around, um, see the views, and then come back and see where the night takes us. We'll probably go into the city center tonight because they have Christmas lights everywhere. That's one of the things that I've loved the most about coming this time of year to go see everything because they have Christmas lights literally everywhere you take a taxi and it's like the entire street so it's december 10th and that's the plan for today and we found a little hiking path so we're hiking up and we'll see where it takes us it's literally so fresh up here but I'm in rain boots so I can only go so far there's even little painted rock up here I'm literally in the mountains my dad went all the way up there he's running back right now this is like probably the prettiest place we've been to so far it's so pretty it's so fresh. He wants to come back tomorrow so we can like actually hike it and go all the way up to the top of the mountain, but I feel so at peace. And we made a wish to the Black Madonna, which was inside the church. And it's like, you pass by her and you're supposed to make a wish for your life and like pray. And we also saw the Escalonia, which is like the boys choir sing. So it's just been a really good day so far. And this is just, I'm so at peace. Like coming from the city to this, it's just like amazing. Hi, Morris. <laughs> Seriously, so pretty. Ah, I feel like I'm in a movie, a little enchanted forest or something. It's so cute. Look how far it goes. I think it said it's like 1.45 miles total or, so, or two to get all the way to the top, which is up there. It's literally so epic. <laughs> just been chilling for a little bit but now we're getting ready to go to a flamenco show we booked tickets like super last minute but there was still tickets for tonight at 10 so we're all getting ready for that and we might go to the hard rock cafe to have like a snack or drinks or dinner right before um but we're really excited this is like our first show of the whole trip so it should be exciting but i tried on the let me show you i tried on the pants that i bought at pull and bear that was the name of the store that we went to the other day and they're actually so cute. I put them on with this black turtleneck because that's all I have right now, but I think it'd probably look cuter with like a sweater or something or like a crop top and something a little bit more fitted, but this is what I have for now. I'm so wearing this and then just black boots. But yeah, if they let me film, I'll film the show, but we're on our way. Mom, wave.
today is our last day in Barcelona. We are going back to Madrid for the last little part of our trip. It's a no makeup day because we're just traveling and we're leaving the cutest Airbnb so I'm sad but we are going back. We're going to be in Madrid for three more nights and then we're going home. So it's the last part of our trip but I'm really excited. My birthday is tomorrow so we're going to be celebrating my birthday there. Um, and I'll probably end the vlog tonight. I'm going out with my friend tonight. I have a friend in Madrid that I met there. So I'm going out with her tonight, but yeah, after that I'll probably end the vlog. We are back in Madrid. Our hotel room is so cute. I'm obsessed. Me and my sister are staying in this room. And my parents are staying in another room. I'll show you around, but this bathroom is just like gorgeous. Like getting ready here tomorrow is going to be amazing. And the shower. The train ride was kind of rough because it was just really full and me and my family uh, couldn't sit together. Our tickets were like in random places, but we're finally here. I'm going to go start to get ready because I'm already running late to meet my friend and then we're going to go to dinner. Let me show you the room. And then this is our little view. You can't really see much, but I'm like obsessed with this building. I think it's so cute. And the rooms are pretty good size, but for me, but for my sister. And the decor is just like super, super cute. All these books, so. I'm gonna get ready and I'll see you guys in a minute. We got room service. Look at this little egg that's the wine holder. It looks like a dinosaur egg, doesn't it? <laughs> It is the next day. It's my birthday. I turned 26 today. This is my little birthday brunch fit. It's very dark grunge vibes, but I'm into it. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching this travel vlog. I've had so much fun. I'm still here for another two days and I'm gonna start another vlog today for my birthday and the rest of the trip. So still watch that video after this. If you like this video, please consider subscribing. I love traveling. I love making travel content and also just lifestyle and other content as well. But thank you so much for watching again and I will see you guys next time. Bye.